In this week, I'm going to share with you a few of the resources for getting up to speed with effects if you're interested in learning more about them. One of the best ways is going to the help menu in After Effects and selecting After Effects Help. Down towards the bottom of the After Effects Help, there's an effects category, and there's even galleries of the effects. So let's say, for example, I'm looking at the Generate Effects Gallery, and I'm curious to see what a certain effect does. At a glance, I can just look and see what a particular effect does. Say, for example, the fractal effect or the ellipse effect. And if I want actual help for that effect, I could go into the Generate category here under Generate Effects, and I could click on, say, for example, the fractal effect. And here's a bunch of information, probably more than you could ever care to know, about the fractal effect. As you can see here, every category is here, all the effects are here, the Psychor effects are not here, unfortunately, but the other ones are here, and it's a great resource to really learn what effects can do. They also have a bunch of tips and helpful things you wouldn't think would be in here, but they are. It's really one of the best resources on effects out there. And if we go to lynda.com, of course, After Effects there, lynda.com is just great supporters of After Effects. So if you look under After Effects, this is what's up there right now because CS4 hasn't been released yet. But I did a title called After Effects CS3 Effects. There's a movie on every single effect in After Effects. As you can see, it's almost 12 hours long. Also, in Beyond the Basics, we delve really deep into effects as well. So there's just a few resources if you're interested in getting more out of effects.